channel, Kaylin Dress here and for today's video, I want to share with you guys my few tips on how to take good photos during your solo travel. So just a quick PSA, a little disclaimer, I'm not a professional photographer and all of my tips are just based on my knowledge and my experience during my solo travel here in Chicago. So as you may already know, I'm here in Chicago for the past 8 months. And I've been solo traveling and most of my pictures are just taken by me. So I've been getting a lot of questions and comments from my friends on how I take these photos. So if you want to know my tips, just keep on watching. So my first tip for you guys is to dress up, do your makeup, and prepare for the photo. Especially when you traveled all the way to another country just to you know take pictures and of course you don't want to look lousy on the photo so kailangan maganda tayo sa pictures diba and we look prepared we look decent on the photo so that's my first tip for you my second tip for you guys is to do not be shy while taking the photos alam ko it's very intimidating kapag ka maraming mga tourists or strangers na nakakakita sa inyo or nakikita niyo while taking the photos it's okay it's very normal and just remember, ito lang yung tatandaan nyo na you will never ever see all these people ever again. So don't regret not having the picture on that spot. So don't be shy while taking the picture. And my third recommendation for you guys is to, you know, practice your pose while at home. Para kapag dating nyo dun sa destination or dun sa tourist spot, um, alam nyo na kung ano yung angle nyo, kung ano yung pose yung gagawin nyo, and you already look cute on the camera. So, you wouldn't have to take so much time taking pictures. Kasi, of course, ayaw mo naman yung tititigan ka na lang nila na ang tagal-tagal naman ni ate girl mag-picture. <laughs> diba? So, at least if you already practiced mag-post at home, alam mo na kung ano yung pictures na you look cute. Diba? Alam mo na yung angle mo. So, number four is to go there on the tourist attraction or destination during weekdays para wala kang masyadong kaaga, wala kang kalaban na ibang turista na magpipicture on the same spot. Tapos, alam mo yun, yung ang dami yung, ang dami mong, um, anong tawag sa kanila? Nakalimutan ko na yung tawag sa kanila. Photobomber! Yun. Para hindi masyadong maraming photobomber on your picture. So, ayun yung marirecommend ko. Just go there during weekdays. And my fifth tip for you is get the tripod and the remote shutter. It's very life-saving. Sobrang ito yung naging best friend ko while solo traveling. So, you really have to get this. So, that's it. That's all of my tips for you and I hope that I made sense and I hope that I helped you guys for your next solo travel. So see you on my next video. Bye!